one pack of Lady Vagabond Lifestyle, uh, 12 by 12. And I used some sheets from the background papers. So, um, well, you need the background papers because otherwise you have two large images for making your album. So I really like to combine the two and well, I think they came out, it came out really nice. So this is the album. Um, I put something between because otherwise the acetate will glinster a little bit. But you see, this is uh, an album. It's eight and three quarters wide and eight and one quarter in height. And the spine is three inches. So it's a really big album and uh, I made it with the simple binding method and um, well I think that's really a fast and easy way to make an album without cracking your spine in, at the outside. So these are little cutter parts from the paper which I uh, bagged with cardstock and here you see the acetate window. I really like it. So I open it and I put this out. So now it is, can lay flat. And this is um, a method I really like because you can see it here. I have a, a little bit more space. So the album can, the, the pages can lay flat and uh, well, not standing up like this. <coughs> So the inside of the cover here is the cat and this is a big pocket and you can open it and put all your pictures in here or the things you want to remember and want to keep. So Lady Vagabonds and a little twine to close it all. So, page two, um, here a pocket, also with an acetate window, so you can tuck in your photos or other things you want and you can show your pictures here and if you don't want it, there is a little card and you can put it here, like that. Um, here a um, um, die. Um, how do you call it? It's, um, well, I'm out of the English names, but it's like this. And then I'll change a little bit the view. It opens and you have four more places for your pictures. And of course, this is open so you can put your picture under the sticker. Well, then page three. These are little photo cards, and this big photo cards, you can really put a lot of pictures, maybe two big ones or four little ones, like what you like, and two little cards. And these cards, they hold close these uh, windows. So open it. And here your pictures, and of course, here your own picture. And you close it all with these photo cards. Then the next page. This is a flip page. It goes up, and there's one that goes down. Well, like this. And in the middle the music and the um, fireplace and it closed with a magnet and on the right page um, uh, I'll, I'll stop here because you can see here the, the space I left so it's uh, then you have two hinges one uh, half inch for putting it gluing it in your cover and one half uh, inch for making it turn better. So it's a really nice method and it looks uh, lovely like this. So I think I will be doing, will be doing this, um, this method more often. Here a flap with place for one photo 
And this is also a flap, but it's, uh, it's an envelope. So you can put some more in the envelope. And also this is a magnet, so it's stuck when you close your book. This side is a pocket with some photo cards. And these are from the paper, they are um, six, almost six by six. So I made a card. And of course you can put in a lot more than I do now, but for now it's enough. Um, here two windows, two doors. And inside also a pocket with two photo mats, oh, two photo mats, and also a big card, six by six. And this is one of the um, chipboard, die, chipboard parts, and I put a magnet beneath so it closes and keep, keeps it closed. At the left again, a little flip to up and down. And at the right side, there is here a belly band with a big photo card and a smaller one. And also a big, a big pocket. And in there I put two smaller cards. These are a5, so about uh, 4 by 6 inches, and they are also from the paper. You will recognize if you have the papers at home. So, and you can put the cards in here. And here is a belly band for some more. And then we come at the end, and this page I really like. Um, not because of the colors, but uh, about the design, but because this is a, a place where you can stack a photo, like, like this. It's open and you can put your photo in here or here and then you stack it in the acetate window and then you can see it here. So I really liked it and of course you can put more in it, but for now it's enough. And here a place for your photos. You can put some uh, da, some um, chipboard in or some thing you, you fussy cut and you can always put something more. So these are all from, from the paper. And in the back cover, I had a little, um, well, like a waterfall, not really a waterfall, but um, it's, a, it's a card with one, two, three, four places for a photo. And of course, here is also a space for another photo if you want, or you keep it like this. Start where you are. Well, the back, I did not show you that. And here. Are we where we started? So, well, I think it's a, it's a, it came out as a really nice album. Uh, it took me a lot of time to come to make uh, all the images and all the uh, colorful paper to one album, but I think I uh, managed to do that. So, if you like this album and if you like my video, please give me a thumbs up. And maybe I'll see you next time on my YouTube channel. Okay, bye bye.